detailed step-by-step -step installation instructions to ensure you a clean, simple, and effective cork roll install. Step 1. Determine and measure the exact area to be covered with cork. Make sure to write down these dimensions. Step 2. Prepare the surface area that is to be covered. Surface should be smooth and free of any loose wallpaper or paint. Sand, vacuum, and wipe with a cloth if necessary. Surface must be clean and dry. If installing onto new drywall, the surface should be first primed. This will prevent the glue that will be used from soaking into the drywall. Step 3. If necessary, use a pencil, level, square, and tape measure to mark out the wall where the cork will be installed. Step 4. Mark the cork in preparation for cutting. Unroll cork to appropriate length and place on a firm cutting surface with the outside of the roll facing up. It is this side that will be marked for cutting. Although both sides of the roll look the same, it is best to use the outside cork surface for easier installation. Be sure to check corners for squareness before cutting. Step 5. Cut the cork roll. Use a meter stick or any other firm, straight edge and line it flush to the cut line. Use a sharp utility knife or carpet knife to make the cuts. Be sure to dry lay your cork to check measurements before applying any glue. Step 6. Applying the glue. Use only a water-based contact cement for adhesion. Follow the manufacturer's instructions as shown on the contact cement container. Using a cloth or brush for smaller areas, and a roller for much larger areas, apply the adhesive to both the wall area and the pre-cut roll. Here we used a drop cloth to keep from spilling any on the floor. Painter's tape could also be used if necessary. Allow the contact cement on both the wall surface and the cork to feel completely dry to the touch before installing. The glue will turn from milky white to clear when dry. Step 7. Install the cork to the wall surface. Once the adhesive is dry to the touch, carefully place one edge of the cork along the marking on the wall. Gently press this edge into place. If satisfied with the location, slowly move the cork along the guide pressing bit by bit gently into place. Working with contact cement can be tricky. Once the cork and the wall make contact, the bond will be firm. Be sure that cork is exactly where desired before making firm contact. After the cork is up, once again press the cork firmly to the wall in all areas to ensure a full surface bond. That completes our instruction video.